Hello YouTube, this is DrawingKid1313 and welcome to another one of my installation tutorials. In this video I'm going to be showing you how to install Minecraft Forge. The version that I have, I will bring it up right here, the version that I have is 4.1.2.265 is the most up-to-date version that I found on the Forge website and uh, yeah, I'm going to show you how to install it. Now for some of you, you may be saying, well, Minecraft Forge, that's like the easiest thing to install, but a uh, pretty recent thing that I've been seeing is that some people have been having problems installing it, so I'm like, alright, I guess I'll just make a video about it. So I'm going to show you how to install it two ways, one using the regular way in your .minecraft folder, and then another way in MultiMC, that program that you see right there. So first, let's go ahead and install it their usual way. You're going to find your .minecraft folder. If you don't know where this is, you can find it easily by pressing the Windows button, typing percent app data, percent, and this will bring you to your RAMing folder. You could also just go to your hard drive, users, your name, app data, roaming, and all that fun stuff. All right. So then, once you have that, uh, you click on your .minecraft folder, and you go into your bin, and you right-click on minecraft.jar, and you say open with WinRAR Archiver. You're going to click on that meta Inf folder right there and delete it. Make sure you delete it. If you don't delete it, it won't work. Alright, so the next thing that you're going to do is you're do going to double click on your Minecraft Forge. And see all these things inside here? A whole bunch of files. You're going to select every single file that is in here. So everything from CPW all the way down to yu.class. I'm going to go right there. I'm going to put it in there. Press OK. It's going to copy it. Then you could exit out of everything, and that's it. You're done. You go into Minecraft. You can log in. It's going to do that stuff. And in any second now, we should see it load up. There we go. We have Minecraft Forge. So you can see uh, right there, Minecraft 1.3.2, it tells you the... Uh, Forge mod loader, then it also tells you Minecraft Forge version, it tells you how many mods you have loaded, how many mods are active, click on them, see, um, you know, information about them, and all that fun stuff. Very simple to install, and uh, just, you know, very useful. So now that we have that finished, we're going to go ahead and exit out of that, we're going to go into MultiMC, go into MultiMC, um, I guess I'm not using the most up to date, I'm sorry. Um, but it should still be the same if you do uh, update. Um, you're going to click on that, you're going to add a new instance, just name this Minecraft Forge. There we go, we now have a new instance named Minecraft Forge. We're going to right click on it, click edit mods, you're going to go to your jar mods right there. Make sure that this isn't jar mods because if it's any other folder, it's not going to work. So you're going to take your jar mods, you're going to click and drag Minecraft Forge into the jar mods. You're going to click close, you're going to click play. I'm going to log in, do all that fun stuff, it's going to download packages, that fun coding stuff. It's going to launch it, you'll see the same thing that you saw when we used uh, the regular way. And in any moment we should see that it's going to load up. There we go. So we now have Minecraft again, we have Minecraft Forge, it tells you the versions, it tells you the mods loaded, how many mods are active, you can go ahead and you can check them out, read the information about them. And uh, that's pretty much it. That's It's that simple. Um, but again, some people were having uh, problems with it, so I figured, yeah, I'll make a uh, report bug. It's a ladybug. Um, but, you know, some people are having problems with it, so I figured I'll make a video. That way it's easier. Um, so the links of where to get Minecraft Forge will be in the description of the video. Um, I will also have links in the video to uh, other videos that I have made. Um, one being where to get other versions of Minecraft Forge because sometimes some mods require certain versions of Minecraft Forge. So it's always nice to know where to get every single different version of Minecraft Forge. So I'll have that up there. And then I'll also have a, uh, a video up there about how to send an error report. That way if something doesn't work, you can go ahead and send me the error report. That way I can take a look at it and see what you did wrong. So I want to thank you for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. And... Uh, you know, do a lot of fun stuff, it'll really help me out, and join me in my next video. See ya!